neglecting prayers. We all have dreams and goals we want to achieve. It is normal for us to just stand up and go out and pursue those things. But have you forgotten that when God is involved in something, victory is sure. When you do not commit your life into the hands of God through prayers, demonic doors will be opened and have access to your life before a thing takes place in the physical. It has already taken place in the spiritual. Not everyone is happy that you are alive. Not everyone wants to see you happy. So praying in the morning is very important for your life and health. The Bible made us understand that the devil is like a roaming lion looking for whom to devour. The only way to escape the trap of demons is through prayers. Do not allow the struggle of life make you forget the place of prayers because everything you see in this world is of vanity. Therefore, if you want to enjoy this world and escape the dangers of demons in your life, always communicate with the Father. Jesus has already set an example for us to follow. It is recorded that early in the morning, Jesus went out to pray. Do you know that Jesus needed to be spiritually ready and strong to overcome the temptations of the devil? He prayed because he wants us to follow his footsteps. Prayer is the key. It is the only way to communicate with God. And I want you to never forget that Jesus started with prayers and ended with prayers. All powers in heaven and on earth belongs to Jesus. And if you want to have this power over demons, then whenever you see the breaking of a new day, never forget to pray and commit your life into the hands of God because whatever that is committed into His hands is safe. Making Negative Proclamation Having a positive mindset is very important because it makes demons scared of you because you know who you are. When you wake up in the morning and all you think of are negative things, it will make demons meddle with your life because that is what you have already proclaimed. Everything does not have to be perfect in your life before you should think positively. Whether things are bad, think positively because the Bible made us understand that as a man thinks in his heart, so he is. When you think of death, failure, sickness, and poverty among others, those are the kind of things that will happen to you. now. When demons know that you are expecting negative things, they will bring it your way because that is what you ask for. Therefore, every time you wake up, make positive declarations over your life. The hands of the Lord are upon you. The Bible admonishes that the weak should say they are strong, the poor should say they are rich, and the sad should say they have joy. There is power in positive thinking that will shut every demonic doors over your life. Therefore, every time you wake up, tell yourself that you are the apple of God's eyes, and so no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Learn to use the Word of God to prophesy good things into your life, because there is power in God's Word, and He respects His words even more than His name. You have the power to prevent every demonic doors from opening in your life if only you can declare it with your mouth. Never be sad. There is something that happens to you when you are sad. Things will not just work the way it should work and demons will frustrate your life. Choosing to be happy is not determined by situations or people. It is a choice. No one has the power to make you happy. It is all on you. When you wake up being sad, your spirit will be weak and demons may attack your life but in a situation where you are happy, your spirit will be strong and the enemy will be unable to have access into your life. Things may not go as planned, people may have disappointed you but do not allow that to weigh you down. You do not know what the day has in store for you. So if you keep allowing the pain and disappointment of yesterday to determine how you will react today, you will never find peace. There is strength in being happy or having joy because the joy of the Lord is your strength. Demons do not come to people that are happy and joyful. They only come to people that are unhappy for certain reasons and are always sad. 
Therefore, whenever you wake up in the morning, always ensure that you are happy because sadness brings bad luck and it opens the doors for demons to your life. Do not allow the pains of yesterday make you live in sadness today because something great will happen in your life if only you choose to be happy and stay positive. Do not be angry. Anger is a dangerous thing that can open demonic doors over one's life. No matter what happens, ensure you do not wake up angry because you will end that day in anger. Anger has a way of making bad things happen to you. The devil uses anger and bitter people to carry out his evil plans. When you are angry, your thoughts will be full of evil and if you are not careful, you may end up doing things that you regret in the future. Look at the story of Cain in the Bible. Cain was angry with his brother Abel because the Lord accepted the offering of Abel and rejected his own. Because Cain was full of anger, the only thought that came to his mind was to kill his only brother. Abel, and because of this evil act, the Lord banished him. This is what anger does to a man. So forgive people no matter what, because in the end, you will be doing yourself a favor. When you wake up in the morning, take away every form of anger and bitterness so that it will not attract demons into your life. Being angry is not a good thing, and it is not a good way to start your day. Learn to forgive and forget to prevent the devil from gaining access to your life. Do not allow anger to be a part of you. Do not have evil intentions towards others. You live in a world with different people and sometimes people may treat you wrongly. But I want you to know that when you think of evil, it will come to you and it has a way of attracting demons into your life. No matter the wrong that a person may have done to you, Never think of evil towards them. The vengeance is of the Lord, and the Lord is the one that will fight your battles. The day is too early to think of evil things. When your mind is full of evil, the devil will convince you to carry out your evil plans, and God will be unhappy. Control your thoughts. Always think of good things that will glorify God, and not things that will bring shame to His name. The Bible made us understand that whatever thing is pure, lovely, good, righteous, think of those things, but anything contrary to those things, flee from it, because it will attract demons into your life. Do not be the judge of others. Focus on your own life and how you will grow. Do not give the devil a chance in your life by allowing evil to fill your heart. When you wake up in the morning, Think of good, pure, and righteous things and your day will be fruitful. But if you do the opposite, your life will never amount to anything meaningful. Evil is an attribute of demons and should not be found in the midst of the children of God.